Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com. Today is Wednesday the 21st of March and this is my daily look at our stock signal service and just picking one of the uh, many signals we have on the weekly, daily, 60 minute time frame, both long and short. So our members uh, can view the uh, videos here and also in the members area. It's very simple. We go to potential long trades or short trades. We click the members click here and they click on the big image and download the spreadsheet. So have a look at the spreadsheet for today. So I've gone for longs today. The, the, at the moment, there's some big swings each day. So quite big daily ranges. Uh, very difficult to set up some set up some of the 60 in the daily time frames, both long and short, because we're we're, we're one day we're 400 points minus and down on the Dow. The next day it's pulled back 200, and it's quite difficult. So sometimes it's best just to step back, go to a larger time frame like the weekly. Look for something that's in a long term bullish trend that's pulled back, found good support, and look for a longer term swing trade. So I've chose the weekly time frame uh, on longs and I've gone for CGNX. So let's have a look at the chart. Okay, so this is the weekly chart for CGNX, and I'm using the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite from Wave 5 Trade, and this is the Ninja Trader version. It is also available for Think or Swim. Trade station and multi charts. So, for our members, just to remind you, very, very simple. We've got these lows here um, around about um, February 2016. Uh, we got this low point, and then we've got we've, we've had this really big move. This is what we've got to look for that really big third wave move so we've got to look for the bottom of that and that's here because this is pretty much range bound to the left there so we've isolated the wave count and just to remind everybody the filters on the scanner results uh, give the 535 oscillator which is the green and red oscillator down here uh, between the 90 and 140 percent the stochastic crossing over in the oversold zone and the wave 4 pulling back into one of our high probability zones. So that's just the basic filters to give you a good start. Now we look more closely at CGNX on the weekly. We can see the wave 4 has pulled back into the green zone, found support, and this is an 85% probability it's going to go on and make a new wave 5 high into our automated target zones, around about $80 there in the blue. So what we've got to do is look for an entry. We've got to be quite conservative here. Uh, we're going to make sure this, this support level is holding at the moment. We want to make sure we're well away from that. Uh, so this current candle is this particular week. Uh, and then what we're looking for is next week or the week after getting outside of the 6-4 moving average high. Uh, above all of this big support level here, all these weeks here, we're uh, really at this support level around about 60 60, 88, 61 dollars, big support level there. So we want to be above that as well. So we've, I've gone for a 61.65 entry long on CGNX on the weekly time frame for a, for a longer term swing. Uh, stop loss is just below the wave four here. The, uh, the wave four low is around 51.46. So you need you need you know a 51. Um, 36 and like 34 something like that just about 10 cents be, uh, below the wave four there because we're on a weekly uh, and then we've got a risk to reward between our stop loss and entry of one to 1.6 1.7 something like that into the target zone there so a decent risk reward you must be aware that this type of swing trading uh, if you're going to trade options takes around it could take up to 20 weeks uh, anything from 9 to 20 weeks depending on market conditions so once we get the move up through this previous support level outside of the 6-4 moving average the momentum should have built uh, more with this on the weekly time frame but you've still got to be prepared to uh, go anything from 9 to 20 weeks so just to recap uh, this is potential long on the weekly time frame, so longer term swing on CGNX. It came from the Wave 5 Trade Stock Signal Service, uh, and I've used the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite from Wave 5 Trade for the Ninja Trader version. So simply, uh, the, the entries at 61.65 to go long, 
the short is at 5134 uh, the stop loss and the end the targets around about $80 into our automated target zone so that's it for today have a great trading day and I'll speak to you all tomorrow